All right, guys, our third and final two shots. We're going with the 16 pellet, 31 cal, roll crimped, new Chidite hull, 27 grains of long shot, and the Ranger Elite wad that we loaded earlier. If you just, if you hadn't watched the previous video with the 30 cal's done, you need to go back and check out that video. That that was two of the most insane type patterns I've had back to back different guns. But we're gonna try this one, the first one, 16 pellet 31 cal in the Stoger M3500. And we'll see what we got here. It rocked it. Everything is looking great on the holes, guys. Primers are turning out fine. Brass is looking great. They're three inch magnums. They got some pop to them with 27 grains of long shot, but that's to be expected. And uh, it is what it is when it comes to that. We ain't trying to shoot him with a game load. I'm so stickered up, it's hard for me to tell from back there. But if it does near as good as that 30 cal done, whoo. And I believe it did, folks. Yes, it did. Wow. Okay, let's, oh, we want to zoom in that direction. Wow, okay, this Ranger Elite, if you're wanting tight patterns, it's going to be really, really hard to beat this Ranger Elite wad, guys. 16 pellets, 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, oh, all 16 of them's there, okay, my bad, 16 of them's there, you got 10 inches, by 10 inches. It's a 10 by 10, all 16 pattern pellets of 31 cal in a Stoger M3500. That is my son's gun. He loves that thing to death. I can see why. That's an, mm. Mm, Jesus. Mother Mary Joseph. Let me put a new sticker right there. Don't blow three holes in the same hole. I need to take this load on out. This is one of them loads. I need to take both of these to 30 cal on this load. I need to run these on out there to 50 and 60 yards and see what's going on with them. I posted this in Deer Hunt with Dolls, the last load. And it's, well, most of the guys seem to... They, they like that stuff, really tight stuff. I do 40 yards because most time out here, when Dawes is burning him up and running him to me, I try to let him get close to me as I can. I, I ain't, I'm not big on letting him slide on out, so. Little dirt job. I don't want that up there. Okay. Now my son's gun right there definitely was walking the dog on that load. Let's go try the same load in the TriStar G2 Viper there. 
this ranger elite well there's one the ranger elites right there guys that thick wad man that thing is it gets all chewed up as you can see on the back end but that's all right i don't care what it looks like performed great <clears throat> these are taking things to a whole new level with these was I want my last hull back somewhere around here I think I probably slung it over in the bushes and I'll have to go find it okay last one one more 16 pellet 31 cal purple bingo chip two of them uh, 27 grains a long shot ranger elite wad uh, ballistic products original buffer pretty looking rounds guys almost hate to shoot him at the deer but i will and we're gonna do it in the tri-star this time all right here we go folks This Ranger wad, it's kind of funny because I have been using them for a long time in turkey rounds. Never even once thought about, I think I did years ago. I tried to put some double on in it and I realized it wouldn't fit and that was the end of that. <laughs> Never did try nothing else with it. Well, I pulled that shot for sure, but it's still an awesome pattern, but I pulled it. Not quite what Zach's is, but it's real close to it. Okay, let's see here. All right. Looks like I got a couple up higher in the Zach and a couple down lower. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now I got all 16 of them on there. I just shot to the right. But Zach's gun definitely likes that 31 cal a little better than mine. Because if you take the farthest one down there, the one up here, that's 17 inches. Width-wise, it's, it's not wide at all. 17 by 8. If I'd have been aiming over here to the left, all this would have been in the bullseye, though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten of them would have been dead bullseye. If I'd have been aiming over here where I was supposed to be aiming. Either way, guys, that's a good load. Works great. It appears the 30 cal is better in my gun than in Zach's. But the 31 cal is better in Zach's gun than it is mine. That's, that's just a difference in guns. I would I would take that deer hunting all day. This is probably a bit too tight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten or sixteen of them, guys. In a five inch by three inch pattern. It'd be if you hit him though, you wouldn't have to worry about him going nowhere, that's for sure. <clears throat> I don't know, but I'm getting old and it's hot and I don't like getting beat on by these shells that much anymore. Calling it a day after I pick up all my tacks I just threw on the ground. Anyway, guys, stay tuned to the next one. The Ranger Elite is definitely an awesome buckshot round. Stay tuned.